welcome to my channel, Bo and Arrow Tarot. Today we're going to get into the daily outlook for fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius for February 5th. And let's get right into it. Of course, uh, you know, if you're a regular, that I'm giving away my Love Oracle deck or this or Love Oracle deck from Island Time Wellness Company on Etsy. If you're interested in being in the giveaway for the deck, all you have to do is be subscribed to my channel. And give me a comment letting me know that you are interested. All right, guys? So let's get into it. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius for February 5th. Show me what's going on for my fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Of course, the video is timestamped so you can jump ahead. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Show me. All right, Aries, twin flame energy coming in for you today, February 5th. They're right there. Leo, the sword and the rose, clarity, truth, solidarity in a relationship coming in. The axe for Sagittarius, breakup, separation. Wow. All right, Sagittarius, that's for you. I am a Sagittarius myself, so... It's interesting to see what messages are coming up. Let's move this up just a little bit. All right, let's get your spread out for today, February 5th. I say today because it's, you know, the reading is for February 5th, but it is, of course, premiered the day before. So, right. so Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, what's going on February 5th for my lovely fire signs? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Today is the day for the weeklies to come out, Aries through Virgo, so check it out. They should be premiering at the same time. All right, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius for February 5th. Aries, you have Empress and the Devil. Leo, you have Lovers, Queen of Wands. And Sagittarius, you have Seven of Wands. And a six of wands. Bottom of the deck, we have page of swords. So page of swords for today is an overall feeling of fighting, you know, negativity, fighting any kind of sort of self-doubt, you know, not letting negative thoughts sort of invade you or your mind or your purpose. So let's get right into it. Aries, twin flame energy today. Interesting, right? So some of you are dealing with certainly a union today, a twin flame energy. You might be sort of meeting up with your lover or, um, you know, connecting with your soulmate, your twin flame. Today is generally a day of nurturing, though, for you, Aries. You're going to be pampering yourself a lot. There will be um, some energy there with the devil, right? So the devil generally is temptation in a lot of ways uh, coming in or perhaps triggers that may come in. And when I say temptation, in the tarot, we don't look at the devil as an outside entity that's tempting you. The devil is just simply our desires to either be enslaved by our passions and tempted by our addictions, right? Or to rise above. Can you rise above, right? So... Today is going to be a day where you might be battling some triggers, right? You might be battling that side of yourself. You may be giving in to some of your addictions or your sort of baser passions, right? And yet, on the other hand, you do have Empress energy. So today is definitely a day of nurturing yourself. It's almost as if, you know, I'm going to say it's almost as if you need to do more of that Empress energy so you can have the strength uh, to deal with this devil energy coming in for you, right? Um, interesting devil energy can also sometimes mean codependent relationships, right? But you have twin flame here. So again, it's like, it feels very much like a choice day, right? It's a choice day. Do you do what's good for you? Do you pamper yourself? Do you nurture yourself? Or do you sort of allow yourself to descend, you know? Um, and it may even be a choice between two lovers as well. Do you go with your twin flame or do you sort of go down another path altogether? It'd be very interesting if you're resonating with this. Let me know in the comments. Leo, the sword and the rose. 
So today is all about solidarity in a union, right? The sword and the rose and the lover. So it could be that you and your lover come to some sort of clarity today some kind of understanding. It certainly feels like an important sort of conversation is being had, right? Um, and that uh, there is sort of an understanding that you're coming to, right? Uh, that's what the sword in a rose really kind of means. It means almost like this understanding between two people that you sort of agree to a common purpose, a common solidarity, as it were, a common sort of source of strength, right? Together we are stronger. Right. And Queen of Wands comes in. So certainly there is a calling on you today to bring your sort of big girl pants. The Queen of Wands is certainly she is the one that you want to come in, especially when you're dealing with sort of difficult issues, uh, difficult sort of times, tumultuous times. Right. Uh, she's the strong queen. She's the wise queen. She's the queen that comes in and very much sort of uh, learns the lessons that need to be learned. Right. Um, could be that there is a queen of wands in your life, Leo, that is helping you or, you know, in some way aiding you in this union or this commitment in this union. Some of the truth or clarity that could be coming in today about a love connection could be coming from a queen of wands personality, which would, you know, by definition be somebody very strong, somebody who cares for you very much, but certainly someone who's kind of like that very strong matriarchal sort of. Uh, figure. All right, Sagittarius, you're up. So we have the axe for you, and of course, uh, seven of wands and six of pe uh, six of wands. Excuse me. Um. Well, today is a day where you know there's a lot of art. You know, a lot of fighting. I don't even mean so much fighting, but certainly you feel like you're having to defend yourself today against an onslaught or against attack. Could very well be that there's some kind of dynamic that happens that you certainly feel like you're on the defensive. By the end of it, you have a victory. Six of Wands is definitely a victory. But it could very well involve you sort of standing up to someone and, and giving them the axe. Right? Um, it could very well be that this is um, in a, this could be at work. This could be in a friendship, right? Whatever the case is. Today is the day, Sagittarius, where you're dealing with someone who, or you're dealing with circumstances that really feel like they've been attacking you, that you've been really having to sort of fight against for quite some time. And I'm going to say today may be the day, February 5th, where you finally say, you know what, I'm going to, let me cut this pattern. Let me stop this pattern. Let me cut this connection that we have, because this connect, this this defensive mode that you're in seems to be as a result of a connection that you have with somebody. This could very well be a friendship or some kind of connection with someone where you just constantly feel like you're the one on the defensive and you just have enough. And, and as soon as you kind of give the whole situation the ax or you kind of say, look, enough is enough, you immediately get your victory. You know, you immediately feel like, wow, maybe I should have done this a long time ago. You know what I mean? Um, but definitely some of you today, Sagittarius, are going to be dealing with a situation that you've just had enough of. And, um, you know, it's probably been quite exhausting and you just simply can't keep defending yourself or having to feel like you have to defend yourself. All right, guys, this is your February 5th Daily Outlook. Uh, for the sign of Aries, Leo and Sagittarius for my lovely fire signs. Don't forget to let me know if you're interested in the love oracle card giveaway. Just be subscribed. Leave me a comment letting me know you're interested. But other than that, have a wonderful, wonderful day, uh, my fire signs. I'll see you tomorrow for your daily outlook. Bye-bye now.